How old are you now? I'm 57. And if you were to go back in time and have a conversation with your 20 year old self, mm -hmm. what's the best advice you would give to your younger self? Mm. If a bird lands on the branch, does the bird trust the branch or does it trust its wings? And the clue, I've seen many birds land on branches, but what I've never seen is a branch break and a bird fall and die. Trust your wings. Wow. How long have you been a business owner for? On my own? Yes. Five years. I branched off and started my own company. Who was the most important person that you met throughout your career? My mom. Yeah? My mom. Was she a business owner? Or? I, well, of a house, but she taught me the most valuable lesson, and she said, start with a standard. What you accept, you can't change. So if you don't set the standard, the best coaches, the best leaders, right? Think of home plate in baseball. It's 17 inches. The coach don't widen the plate. You got to play to the standard. So when you start a business, you say, my policy is this. So in other words, you got to know your worth. You got to know it. Know your value. You can't give freebies. What was the most amount of money that you've ever made in a single year? Well over seven figures. That's me personal. Yes. What's the most common mistake that you see business owners make in today's world? Right, so you make the strategy and they think it's simple. The strategy plus execution equals results. False. Focus on that plus. Strategy plus who owns what in the strategy. Because if people don't know what they own in your strategy, when two people own the dog, the dog dies. I thought you fed the dog. No, I thought you fed the dog. The dog dies. So it's deliberately clear who should feed the dog so the dog stays healthy. So my business stays healthy.